Hello, this is Sean for Be Your Own Nerd. Now, it seems like it's another day. It's another Mac OS Sonoma bug. Another bug was discovered in Mac OS Sonoma 14.4, and this one destroys saved versions in iCloud Drive. Mac Rumors posted this article, and they've been actually really good about keeping up on all the major bugs in version 14.4, the Mac OS operating system. And according to this article, it says here, according to Electric Light Company's Howard Oakley, users running Mac OS 14.4 that have optimized Mac storage enabled should be aware that they are at risk of losing all previously saved versions of a file if they opt to remove it from the iCloud Drive local storage. And this just isn't the first major bug in version 14.4 of Mac OS. Mac Rumors also has an excellent article on the reasons not to update. And if you go to this article, and I'll put a link below in the description, there's all sorts of problems in the 14.4, including USB hub and monitor ports where they're losing connectivity. I've had this for myself. I have two external drives that I keep plugged into my iMac. And sometimes when I wake my iMac from sleep, either one or both of the drives will be disconnected completely from the computer. I've never had that problem with the previous versions of Mac OS. This is something that's new in 14.4. If you're using Java, if you're a developer and using Java, there's unexpected terminations also with the Java process. There's also printer issues. We removed or corrupted drivers. The audio units plugins will crash from time to time. And of course, the new one, which is the iCloud drive bug that I just discussed. So their recommendation and my current recommendation is if you haven't updated to Mac OS Sonoma 14.4, don't do it. Save yourself the headache. Hopefully Apple will publish a 14.4.1 release soon. I don't see them letting these bugs stay in fester for very long because some of these are quite major bugs that are affecting a lot of users if you read the Apple discussion forums and also if you read the Mac rumors forums as well. A lot of people with a lot of issues with this new version. If you've encountered any of these bugs that are listed here or any new or different bugs that have come up, leave a comment down below. I'd be interested in hearing from you. And once again, this is Sean for Be Your Own Nerd. You can reach out to me at my website, beyourownerd.com. You can also subscribe to my free weekly tech newsletter. And please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe and turn on notifications. Thank you so much and have yourself a great tech day.